There is an artwork that hangs in the foyer of John Simon's magnificent home, inscribed with the words his mother Joyce told him as a young man. Johnny and life think big, really, really big, and then double it again. And in Wingerdale, her son went on to do just that, acquiring the very best site on the shores of Sydney Harbour in 1999 some 98 precious waterfront metres on the very point of Point Piper, with those famous icons laid out right before it, and dedicating the next eight years to creating a place to celebrate and serve his three great passions, family, friends and philanthropy. Just about everybody who knows Sydney knows Wingerdale. It is a big presence on the city's landscape for both its form and its functions. It's been dubbed one of Sydney's unofficial civic buildings for the role it has played on the city's charitable calendar, hosting countless glittering events for hundreds at a time under the breathtaking arc of 6,200 acoustically engineered rods on the ceiling of its famous entertainment floor, crafted to perfectly frame the Harbour Bridge. Every New Year's Eve, there is no finer room to be invited to in Sydney. But the genius and joy is for all that is seen and known of Wingerdale. There is so much that is not. Indeed, even this film will leave much of the Simon family's faces unshown, out of respect for their privacy and possibly that of a future custodian. But be in no doubt, this is one of the great residences of the world in one of the great locations of the world and its capacity to respond to the wishes of its people, be they public or private, is immeasurable. Wingerdale, Point Piper, Sydney Harbour, Australia.